We are here at NAB Show New York. It's been three years since we connected with product experts, discovered alternative workflows, and were able to get our hands on recently released products. Maximizing efficiency is the end game, and there has never been a better, more intimate environment than right here in the Big Apple. Ashley within Broadcast, joining me is Joao of Voice Interaction. Good to see you. Good to see you, Ashley. Good to see you. So you've been in the media and broadcasting market for over a decade now as a closed captioning provider. Can you tell us about your current position in the market and how you're preparing for the near or far future? Um, basically, when we enter in the market, um, in terms, for example, the closed captioning, everything it was manual. Okay, And basically, we starting to present a solution based on AI tools and basically automatic speech recognition to have the closed captioning automatic. And when we look now, basically we see that most of the, the stations starting to adopt this kind of technology, okay? And this is, this is good, okay? Because uh, we're starting by, by using this technology, okay? And to creating this kind of buzz in terms of uh, the, the market and is a good contribution for voice interaction to this kind of market, okay? And what role does artificial intelligence play in your company and how does it benefit with the media and broadcasting industry? Uh, we have um, a large uh, R&D department. Basically, we do a lot of research and uh, development of new products. And this is important, okay? The use of this kind of tools to creating the models for the different kind of markets, different kind of needs to the clients, and the fact that you are using artificial intelligence gives you the power to use data to be able to create these models, okay? And this has been very relevant to us because we have doing a lot of in terms of investment, in terms of research, to be able to create all these kind of products. So before NAB Show New York, Voice Interaction received the product of the year. Congratulations for Overall Connect Las Vegas. What does winning that award mean for you? It's been a, an amazing year, okay? We're starting by NIB, okay? And basically we won for our um, Audimj Media for the closed captioning, okay? We won the, from the TV Tech the award uh, for the Audimj Media. Also for NIB, we received for the Media Monitoring Solution uh, a prize for that category as product of the year. And in top of that, uh, in from the three categories that uh, NAB, uh, NIBS, uh, we, we won the overall, okay, uh, connect, okay. And that it was a great achievement for us. And it continues because also in IBC in Amsterdam, we won also for Audimj Media and for um, Media Monitoring Solution, uh, uh, the prize for uh, best of the year. Okay. Yes, that's very exciting. Yeah, it was very exciting. Very it nice. It was an amazing year. Okay. Yeah, it sounds like it. So how can automatic speak, speech recognition improve a compliance and monitoring solution? Basically, we have been transforming um, a recording and compliance system in something that can achieve you some uh, information about the contents, okay? And this is relevant not only for the engineering department of a TV broadcast that is normally looking only for the compliance on the recording, but also to bringing this kind of system to other different departments on the, on the TV station, okay? And this has been very interesting, okay? Transforming something that is a normal product in something that can give you a lot of winners uh, in terms of what we can get from all this kind of technology for the different uh, departments on the TV station. And so you mentioned that your product can be used by different departments. Can you give us some examples of that? Yeah, for example, the journalism, okay? That means they can just pick in the information they are providing and doing a lot of segmentation. And for example, exporting that, uh, that kind of news for social media, for YouTube, for Facebook the possibility to, to, uh, to enlarge the viewers of that kind of information. Also for the commercial departments, they can look to the, the commercials they are providing, also to the competing ones from the other TV stations. Uh, and also the, the fact that you are incorporating, for example, the, the ratings for the station, okay? And they can compare their station with other stations and trying to 
to look to this data and to give more revenue and to achieve better results also for the, for the broadcaster. NAB Show New York is the last media and broadcasting show of the year. So how has 2022 been for voice interaction? For, uh, we starting by the prizes, it was great, okay? Also, we have been um, achieving uh, new clients, okay? And we are getting a, a more penetration on the markets, okay? And here in the West is one of that, that markets. But also the fact that we have been opened office in Singapore to work with the uh, APAC region. And that also is very important to us in the sense that we are broadened in terms of geographies and we are getting to more, more markets and the possibility to get more clients. How has uh, voice interaction, you've been expanding, is that right, in four offices in different continents. What are your plans for the future? Yeah, it's, um, it's a, a, a large effort to be on different markets. Okay? Not only because we are working for the broadcast market as we are uh, here, for example, for NAB New York, okay? But the, the fact that you are also working in different geographies, okay? And to be present in Europe, here in the West, in South America, and now at the APAC region, is a lot of effort to be uh, on all these markets. And basically what we have been doing is open office there, okay, on these markets. That means you are creating some local um, uh, uh, team in these markets and to be the possibility to work on these markets, not only for the broadcast, but also for the other markets that we are working, okay? And this is great. Uh, it was a, a very successful year, and we are very happy with that. And we are thrilled to also for next year, okay? We have to do better and to, to go behind exactly what we have been doing. Well, you're doing it right, globally and winning awards and yeah. all of that. Yeah, as you say, is it was a... A very exciting year, okay? With we are back to the live events, okay, and also the possibility just to win these all these awards, which is in some way uh, some recognize they are recognizing the work that we have been doing, okay, and the, the quality that we have been doing in this in with these products, okay. As I told you in the beginning, when we starting, all the closed captioning was done manually, okay? And we proved that it's possible to use this kind of technology to bring to the market and to creating good products to give uh, also the opportunities to have better products and better outputs. Okay? That's Definitely cool. something to be proud of. And thank you so much for speaking with us today. We look forward to talking to you again. Thank, thank you. Thank you, nice to meet you again.